Yeah, the deadline to file campaign finance reports was yesterday, and they showed the incumbent City Council President Nick Mosby is facing stiff competition ahead of the May 14th Democratic primary. Mosby's campaign has roughly $183,000 cash balance right now, while Zeke Cohen has a little more than $530,000 on hand. Shannon Sneed has about $169,000 to spend. Switching gears to the Democratic race for mayor, the incumbent mayor, Brandon Scott, is leading the pack. Campaign finance reports show Mayor Scott has about $835,000 in cash, and Bob Wallace has roughly $229,000 on hand. Sheila Dixon's situation is slightly different. She has $370,000 to spend, but she also has a super PAC called Better Baltimore dedicated to supporting her candidacy, with an additional $200,000 in it. $100,000 of that super PAC money comes from David Smith, chairman of Sinclair Broadcast Group and the new owner of the Baltimore Sun. Dixon was asked yesterday if Smith owning the paper could push her campaign forward. He bought the Sun paper, okay, but you know, how, how is that gonna impact what happens to me? And I don't rely on, on papers and endorsements in that respect. People, yeah, because they know what I can do. Dixon went on to say that she's most proud of the endorsements of City Councilman Eric Costello and State Delegate Sandy Rosenberg. You can find full campaign finance reports, including who the donors are, right now on the WBAL-TV app. Live in the newsroom, I'm Tolly Taylor, WBAL-TV 11 News.